So the best thing about this scale is you can put huge packages on it and the screen is totally independent from the scale. So you're never gonna have boxes that cover up your readout. It's got a nice large scale plate here. So you can put big boxes on it and uh, it's not gonna fall over. And then the readout here is connected with a included kind of slinky cable, much like you know the old school telephones. And there's an included power supply as well. So this just plugs right into um, 120 volt outlet, just like this. And another thing that's cool is it has keyhole slots here so you can mount this to a wall. Um, so a lot of people mount this right on the wall behind the plate. So it's always accessible and easy in view. But whenever you turn it on, it's gonna automatically tear the scale. So it'll zero everything out. And we have a few different uh, units or modes that you can uh, choose from. So pounds and ounces, uh, decimal pounds, kilograms or grams. And also at any point you can tear the scale. So if I put something on the scale and I wanna add something to it, I can just hit the tear button, it'll zero everything out, and then I can add something else to it to know the weight of the additional thing. Or you can do uh, subtraction as well. So I can tear that to zero and then remove this, and now it'll give me uh, the negative so I know exactly how much this weighed when I removed it. You can also hold, so there's a hold button. So uh, if you need to move the package around or something and you just wanna save that uh, number so you know exactly what it is, um, that's really handy to have. And the overall capacity is 110 pounds. So this is really perfect for postage, mailing big packages. Now, if you're worried about, I noticed a lot of people in the comments were like, worried about like the precision of the point, you know, one decimal point of the ounces. Like if you're worried about that sort of um, sensitivity with the scale, I would look for a smaller scale that, uh, you know, has maybe a five pound range that will be more sensitive to those small little increments. But I found this thing to be, you know, perfectly sensitive enough for my needs. So you can see it jumps around a little bit with the 0.1 decimal place for the ounces, but I mean, for shipping packages, you know, you're gonna be rounding up anyways, so it's really not a big deal. And lastly, there's a battery compartment on the back, so you can pop in a couple of AAA batteries and you can run this thing without having to use a power supply. Oh, and this cable stretches probably, I mean, I would say comfortably you could stretch this out like three or four feet. Um, it's, you know, kind of like a coil cord, but you don't want to like stretch it so far that you're putting a lot of stress on it. But this is a really great scale for measuring packages.